You know, it's nobody wants to go out there and, and, and not execute with the puck. So um, it's tough when we get out there and the puck's bounced a little bit and we're not making the plays that we normally would make. And um, that comes with the, you know, the, the effort and the mindset we have going into a hockey game. When you look back on it, uh, the uh, flurry of goals in the second period uh, sunk our hockey club. And uh, other than the fact that we thought maybe some of them I'm sure Jonas would like to have back. Some of them went through him, but some of them went between his legs, and those are signs that usually that you know the goalie doesn't have it going that night. And I probably should have done something after the fourth goal instead of waiting for the fifth goal. Yeah, tough game. I, I thought, uh, yeah, we had a little slow start again, but uh, we found a way to kind of get back up to one, and then uh, yeah, second goal. It's it's, it's my fault. It's a bouncing puck, rolling puck, but I uh, still should make the save. And after that, like, yeah, it didn't, didn't look like uh, we really finding our game again. It's easy to sit and criticize the goalie because he's the last line of defense, and there's a lot of things that happened in front of him that they were shooting the pucks from some areas that they shouldn't have been unchecked. But again, in some of the situations, it's always your goalie is your last line of, of defense. and. Jonas has been a stalwart for this hockey club, and he's been probably our MVP in a lot of games. So it's hard to point the finger, but I'm sure he'd like to have some of them back. So you know, I got us good skating this morning after the morning skate, and uh, they told me after there was maybe a chance, and you know, came you know here prepared like I was going to play, and um, when they told me I was going to play, I was pretty excited, and uh, you know, be able to chip in with the goals, I was positive, and uh, you know, definitely uh, felt good to get back in the game out there. Well, today, I think the biggest thing for me was just keeping it simple. Um, you know, uh, the speed of the game is a little quicker than it was when I was down in Syracuse, couple, you know, last weekend, and um, you know, uh, the players are pretty, pretty different too. So I was just trying to keep it simple. You know, you know, keep the puck out of our zone as much as I can. And uh, you know, we had our fair share of scoring chances in the hockey game. It wasn't we were we weren't null and void of scoring chances. We didn't execute enough early in the hockey game, getting through the neutral ice, and it cost us. You know, it's one of those things that. When the puck's bouncing and those things, you got to get back to what you do well and, and what you do effectively. So, we definitely got to take uh, tomorrow and, and work on our skills and get ready for the next one. Yeah, it definitely looks like uh, we, we, we're losing the puck uh, way more often in, in our zone or at, uh, at the blue lines. And um, yeah, it look, looks like we're, feed, we're feeding the opponent instead of uh, putting pucks deep, uh, making simple plays and, uh, and, and play our game. Um, yeah, we, we, we got to. Play simple again. Uh, looks like sometimes we're trying to too, too, too much stuff, uh, too too difficult things, and uh, yeah, it's not working right now. It's huge. I mean, it's uh, you know six of the you know, better teams in the Eastern Conference. They were going over, and you know a couple in the West too. And uh, you know when you go into you know places like Washington and uh, New York and um, Detroit, it's always tough games. You know we start with Chicago, which is gonna be a huge game, and um, you know especially after two tough losses, it'd be uh, you know if we can get a win in Chicago, it'd be good for the you know morale and the confidence of this team for sure. Uh, you know, there's there's lots of room for improvement with our group, and uh, we're not sharp right now with the puck. A lot of passes are going in people's feet. It's uh, bouncing off people's sticks. And we just have to find a way here to get back to where we were and uh, as collectively as a group. You know, tomorrow's going to be a, a work day for us. It's a travel day, but we're going to skate when we get in there, and uh, you know, maybe that's what we needed to get out on the road again and uh, and get together as a group and, and fine tune some of those things.